So I think we're just going to start with the fried cheese sticks for an appetizer. Do you recommend them? Yeah, they're good. But let me put it to you this way. When you're at work tomorrow standing around the water cooler and you tell some of your coworkers that you went to this restaurant, they're all going to ask you the same question. Did you get the crab cakes? Ah, okay. Yes. Yeah, and the crab cakes too then. <laughs> Great. I'll put those in for you while you explore the wine list. Servers, push the ceviche. Ain't nobody sold one all day. Heard. All right. Let me put it to you this way. When you're at work tomorrow, standing around the water cooler, and you tell some of your coworkers that you went to this restaurant, they're all going to ask you the same question. Did you get the ceviche? Okay, definitely one of those. <laughs> Great. Brad, we got one tomahawk ribeye left. It's yours to sell. Okay. Hey, why can't I sell it? Oh, come on, Aaron. You couldn't sell a shell to a crab. Don't they already have a shell? I got you. Thank you. What's your secret, Brad? How do you sell? Simple. I give them a little story, and I make them feel like their life won't be complete without it. Oh. I think we're going to skip the appetizer tonight. Thank you. Yeah, that's fine. But let me tell you about Bill and Mary. <laughs> Bill and Mary were a regular couple, just like you two, and they were trying to save up a little for retirement. So they'd pass on little things like candy at the movies, wax at the car wash, and appetizers at dinner. And then one day, Bill and Mary died in a car accident, <gasps> and their entire oh. retirement was used up on funeral arrangements and their ungrateful children. So, are you sure you don't want that ceviche? What the f I think we should go. Yeah. I'm tired of waiting.